Welcome to the App Interface, a new generation data interfacing tool for Oracle eBusiness Suite release 11i and release 12. App Interface helps you to interface data from any disparate systems into Oracle eBusiness Suite both release 11i and release 12. And uh, App Interface uses the service oriented architecture methodology to do the interfacing between disparate systems to Oracle eBusiness Suite. In this presentation, we will see how to interface eChain ERP payroll data into Oracle's uh, general ledger as a journal in release 12. I'm going to log in into the AppLoad productivity suite as administrator. And I'll show you quickly a few setups here. And the instance setup is very important to configure all the Oracle EBS connectivity. And uh, AppLoad works as a hub to connect with the as many Oracle EBS instances that you want and also other disparate systems. I'll quickly check up the connectivity before we continue on with this uh, live presentation. I'm going to create a loader for loading Oracle's uh, general ledger journal data which is the data coming in from eChain's payroll system. So this is the loader I'm going to use. I'll show you the metadata information behind this XML template. Uh, these are the fields that are currently mapped in the journal loading template. And this is the attribute information of uh, the account combination where the input we collect as a segmented account and uh, behind the scene it is passed in as a code combination ID for processing the journal import process. And this is the translation rule which is used for converting the segmented account into the code combination ID. And uh, the SQL engine in the app load suite is a hybrid one which is capable of handling not only the Oracle database fields but also it can validate against the file system columns and as well the XML input file columns. We'll continue deeper into the metadata structure of this template and uh, AppLoad supports very flexible uh, data input structure and the template comes with a standard uh, input layout but uh, the client has a, a complete flexibility to change the layout the way they want. And if you change the layout, please keep in mind you need to come and do a remapping. And this is the place you would do the remapping. And it is a very simple drag and drop model to do the mapping of Excel columns with the open interface or the API definitions. And AppLoad has a very strong pre-validation engine which helps you to simulate the load before it actually happens on the Oracle EBS side. So every XML template has uh, several preceded pre-validation conditions and also the clients can create or customize the pre-validations to their expectations. And this is the FND global package which is getting initialized and the cursor definition for this uh, loader. And uh, 
this is the API for the general import process which is getting called and upload will also submit the concurrent program uh, directly from the upload system itself so the input parameters are all collected directly from the upload system let me take you through the app extract module where we are going to write an extraction routine to extract the payroll entry data to get interface into Oracle General Ledger. And this is picked from the eChain ERP system. It's picking up the payroll. Uh, data this is the this is a plsql based uh, extraction engine where the extract will come out as an output as a xml and uh, the sql output can be further grouped or summarized and then further filtered using parameters before it is converted into an xml file And uh, the extraction template can be given access to selective users as per the need. And now we are uh, we have created the app load loader using the XML template, and as well we have created the extraction template to extract the eChain's payroll entry data. And both these objects, both the app extracts template and as well the app loads loader template can be orchestrated as a web service using the app interface product. So the app interface sits on top of the app extract and the app load product and makes it enabled to orchestrate both the loading as well extraction as a web service. I'm going to go to the source system here, which is the eChain's ERP system. And I'm going to show you the payroll processing within eChain. And this is the eChain ERP system, flagship product of uh, Chainsys. And uh, at the HR unit level, which is similar to Oracle's business group, we are maintaining the external salary clearance account, which is the Oracle General Ledger's code combination. And also, we are going to map uh, 